Western Division of Los Angeles. Welcome to Pallet. <laughs> Follow her to your table, please. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I'm really happy with the way it came together. I don't even know how it happened, but it makes me happy, so I'm glad you like it. <laughs> so here is our first ticket. First ticket. Carl, four pate. Four pate. What's my time? Carl? What's my time for pickup on steak? Six is good. Uh, sure. I'll just set a timer for six. You want me to pick up in six? Uh, no, not not from now. I just sent it, so I'm gonna wait. Five. I'm gonna wait six and then fire to six. Copy. Somebody went to pick up. Yes, ma'am. Would you like some more water? Um, sure. Thank you. All right, let's fire one chicken, one salmon. Chicken, salmon. How long? Uh, 45 seconds in the window. This is nice. Rustic. Hi there. Hi, Hi. Kami. Hi. You look nice. Thank you. Welcome to District LA. We're very excited to taste all of your food. We'll take one of everything. One of everything? Thank all you. Right, set that up. Jeremy, judges walked in. They want one of everything. We're going to bypass and go judges now, cool? You tell me what to give you. I think the menu looks really good. Um, it sounds very appropriate for, for lunch. It does look nice. I mean, it's one of those menus where everything is very straightforward. It's just simple ingredients. And so you also hope that they're a little more interesting than just a piece of roast salmon. You got salt and pepper on there? Yep. Yeah, again, really charred, dude. Like, grilled, grilled. Cheers to, to another Restaurant Wars. May it be our best. All right, this is judge's table. Kwame! Let's grab these plates. Everyone's getting one of everything, OK? OK. So we'll do corn on their right and truffle salad on their left. Let Piper grab one. Judge's table, guys. Watch your fingers. I need a. Right here. Oh. Is that all four soups? Yes. Why is this such a cluster? I have no idea. This damn course has got to go to the table now. That was a show. Yeah. The asparagus salad is uh, Chef Jeremy. You have grilled asparagus with an arugula salad, truffle vinaigrette, and crispy farm egg. And in front of you is a corn and sage velouté that I made, pancetta, pickled corn, and crispy sage. Thank you. Wow, this soup is really good. I thought this the soup needed a little more seasoning. Really? Like a little bit. Oh, I Maybe did. Maybe just salt. But the salad's well seasoned. This asparagus and egg dish is something I would totally order for lunch. Yeah, it's, 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 this is really appropriate lunch food, I think. I really liked that bright savoriness of the dressing. Yeah, I thought Jeremy's salad was perfect. Welcome to District. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for coming. I think Kwame's doing well. He has a very, I think, genuine and attentive personality. So it doesn't surprise me that he's very conscientious. I have to say, oh I know one table has had their first course. I see only one other table on food, and that's it. They haven't got their first course before. Yeah, I know, dude. We're not worried about the other tables right now. We're going to worry about judges' table. That's it. We'll come back to a la carte. At this point, you know, people are waiting 20, 30 minutes for their first course, and I'm worried that's going to reflect poorly on our team. But I'm just a line cook, and my job is to put food in the window when I'm asked to. Hi. How you doing? Sorry to have you waiting. trying to turn tables as fast as we can. I'm going to make it great. But we still haven't fed like five or 10 tables. It's going to be for 41. They didn't get all the food out. They don't look happy. Uh, I got to say, the service was quick. Yep. Yeah. And the plates are hot. We're going to need some silverware if we're going to eat this. Or maybe heavy too. Dude. Yeah, I thought for you tips twice, we had to ask for drinks twice. Yeah, right? I'm so sorry about that. That's okay. Thanks, Kwame. For your entree, we have Phillips dish. Roasted salmon with ratatouille and Greek yogurt. Amar prepared for you roasted chicken breasts with creamy polenta and a wild mushroom ragu. Thank you. You're welcome. I really like the way Philip cooked his salmon, but I don't know if I like the ratatouille on top of my salmon. I'm finding the vegetables to be undercooked. Yeah. Who made this chicken again? Amar. The chicken itself is moist, but I feel like Amar could have had a little more gravy with the ragu, oh, the sauce, mushroom. Oh, sauce. You have very little. You know, the only problem I'm having with Amar's dish is it's already established that he can serve a chicken breast. We've seen this three times now from Amar's. OK, I get it. It's a little one-dimensional. I mean, yeah. it's, it's the same textures. Nowadays, you've got to stand out. 
It is a little safe. Four asparagus. Four asparagus. Asparagus coming right now, bro. You already had some grilled. You can probably just... Uh... I'm reheating it. District could have been amped up in the creative department a little bit. Well, I mean, I think it'll largely depend on how the other restaurant does for lunch, because if they are creative but they don't execute, then we'll look back and be like, that was great, because everything was delicious and well-seasoned. Yeah, no, it's solid. And I think we should go to the other restaurant, because I think we're late on our reservation. What do you doesn't have their first course here? Okay, it's coming. Yeah. I mean, okay, just talk to me. I think we need to know what's going on, dude. I don't have fires on these lead tickets. Okay. I can't just fire stuff out of my ass. Okay. Yeah. Appreciate it. I know that was a long time to wait. Nobody really seems to be getting up. I realize I need to do something. I was wondering if I'd be able to offer you all a glass of sparkling wine if you wanted to come with me, and I will uh, go ahead and get that for you. Wonderful. Pour four more, please. They don't need to be crazy full, just nice. I don't think that anyone realized why I was doing it. Thank you so much for joining us Thank today. You. Thank you. Wonderful. Thank you. All right, so get this cleared and reset. We are setting this as a six top. There's no hostess. How are we doing back here, guys? We're good, how are you? Good, I need to turn these remaining tables. I'm getting people out of their seats with champagne. Marjorie, you're killing it, baby, you're killing it. Doing good. You guys are too, I love it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> of course, the infamous nobody at the host stand. How are Hi, you all doing? we're well. Follow me, please. I have this table here for you all. Thank you. Karen, after that, three steak, one seafood. Fire first course on judges. Four pate, four beets, all right? Four and four. OK, after we get the judges' food out, we're going to have to do a, like, a boss hall power drive to get the food out. The menu is refreshingly very different from the one we just had. I'm surprised to see a terrine. A terrine, you know, if you're going to do it right, it's like three or four days where you actually want to serve it. Not something I would order, though. Maybe he'll do it really well. Let's not judge it until we've tried it. Oh my god, they're perfect. This is judges, correct, Carl? Yeah, judges. Thank you. We have Carl's dish. Pork and bacon terrine with haricot vert, gem lettuces, prosciutto, and salumi. Next to it, there's marinated beets, as well as a bit of pickled cauliflower and shaved garrocha. Who made this dish? I made this dish. Thank you. Enjoy. I guess you liked the terrine, Tom. No, I didn't. You didn't? Nope. The texture's off, it's not seasoned well. And um, it's kind of chewy. It's almost spam-like. Maybe it was so thinly sliced. The vegetables are interesting. Actually, the whole rest of the dish is more interesting than the terrine. I think Marjorie's beet salad was really nice. It was fresh, the beets were cooked well. I just wonder, if you've got one dish, is this what you're gonna serve us, you know? It's certainly better than a garlic dish. Yeah. What do you think of the beets? I thought they were really good, but it like needed something. It was just too easy, I guess. The first time at a restaurant wars? Yes. Yeah. yeah Me too. It's <laughs> petrifying. <laughs> How do you think Marjorie's doing as front of the house? I think she's doing fine. She was a little flustered at the front door. I mean, obviously, there wasn't someone there. See, I like what the other team did. Kwame was like, you know what? I can't be at the front door, so I'm going to park someone there. We do have silverware, so that's a good sign. I'm going with salad right now, OK? We got judges and the last five. Keep going. I see the home stretch. Hello. That's the beef salad. That's a great lunch choice, doesn't it? This is Karen's dish. It is a bit of marinated and grilled flank steak with shaved carrots, daikon, jicama, cabbage, as well as some papaya in there. And then on your other side, we have the seafood stew, which was made by Isaac. Cod, shrimp, clams, and mussels. Thank you, Marjorie. Enjoy. Thank you. Mm. Karen's dish would be something I could eat for lunch every day. I'd be really happy. This is so far the most interesting thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's got the most guts. The fresh herbs really make it. Thai basil, mint, cilantro, it's all there. There was no waiting for food, which I feel like in a lunch situation is important. 24 hours to put a restaurant together and get the food out of the yeah. Salad's up, too. Now come get them. I think Isaac's, too, could use a little more um, but it was, it was solid. Flavor's good. You get that saffron, fennel flavor that you're kind of looking for. I would rather eat Isaac's seafood stew than the salmon or the chicken, the chicken yeah. at the other place. The stew? That was my favorite. Yeah. It's really good. I liked it. Yeah. Here we go. Sell that. 
This is difficult now. If you look at the two restaurants, I thought District's appetizers were more interesting than the appetizers of Palette, but I think the entrees of Palette are much stronger than the entrees of District. Exactly. Yeah, I agree with you, right. Everything lunch was sort of no harm, no foul. I agree with you. I, it almost feels like they're putting a little more credence into expediting the food and right. to making exciting food. Yeah.